I grew up in the family business and with my brother and my father and later on my sister. And uh, we grew up at Hills in Carisdale and this was our first store we opened in 84. And you know, I still to this day don't know if my father saw a business opportunity when he was making the suggestion or he wanted us to get out of his hair because he's running the main store in Carisdale. So he grew up with work ethic he got from his dad, terrific guy, with an understanding of clothing and, and quality. Brian was built, made for retail. So he had all that, he had all the exposure to it, and then went, I, I can't imagine myself doing anything different. And he got this vision to create a line of women's clothing that would be everyday clothing with high-end luxury quality. We just thought, you know, there's a better way, and it doesn't have to be luxury. Your, your product can be everyday, and that's where the everyday comes from. It can be approachable everyday. You can afford, for most people, wear it everyday. He would go out and identify what uh, the best brands were at the time. So it was sort of a curation of sorts in terms of the product, even back then, making sure that what was being carried in the store was absolutely on point for what he thought was cool or what he thought was um, the best value for the price and then it progressed to identifying well we can't find everything in the marketplace through these third-party brands there's a few things that we're missing so then he had the idea well let's go out and do that ourselves and that was the beginning of when we went vertical and now we're pretty much 98 percent of our product is our, our, our own if your store is populated with your own goods you control the entire supply chain from design to manufacturing pricing to reordering. That was, if there was one thing I would say that was the secret to success from a business perspective for Aritzia in implementing his vision, that was it. I really thought a lot about it, this business model of his, which I think is so phenomenal. And to some extent, I almost call it the Vancouver business model. And he's taken this model, which is, falls right in between a fast fashion at the bottom and luxury at the top and delivered uh, what I would call a West Coast wearable clothing that's better quality, will last three, four, five years as opposed to the fast fashion two, three weeks. I think our company was founded on a set of values that included integrity, which started with Brian. Um, and by integrity, it means regardless of what area of the business we're talking about, it's about doing the right thing. And it might not be the easiest thing, but it's, we, it's what we believe is the right thing. I mean, my father used to always say to me, Brian, the elevator doesn't always go up, so make sure you're, you're somewhat humble on the way up because you're gonna be coming down at times too. So we've had our challenges for sure. And, and uh, you know, fortunately, uh, they've been uh, infrequent, but they've been meaningful at times. COVID-19 was probably the most profound example of all of our philosophies and values coming together. We kept coming back to how do we take care of our people in a time when it's uncertain for them. And we made the decision not laying off or furloughing a single person. We just tried to make the right decisions for our people at that point in time, both from a health perspective and financially from that perspective as well. We came out of COVID in a much stronger position than when we even entered in. And it was an amazing testament to what we can do as a team and as a group all together. There's something about his ingredients of leadership that um, draws like total commitment. And that's incredibly special and very unique to him. You know, I think if we look back in the history of Ritzia, we always had a vision. We might not have had a vision to be a multi-billion dollar company, but we certainly had a vision to be a lot incredibly successful and uh, you know, ranked up there with some of the best organizations in the world in our industry. This year being our 40 year anniversary, we built a phenomenal business that has so much more runway to go based on his original vision. He's able to deliver a better quality product at a better price than anyone in the world, which is why I think Aritzia works.